guys i'm back with another video it's mg mods yes it's mg mods long time no see right yeah i'm back with the honda coming in 2020 hot you know happy new year's again everybody who watches my channel thank you i appreciate all the love 2019 was good now we're gonna move into a new year and bigger and better things to come but today i'm gonna show you how to install this lip that i got from my car this, I got side skirts and lip. So I Watch. got this Easy Lip Pro off Amazon and Easy Lip um, side skirts. I got two of them, one for each side. And uh, I've been holding this one actually for a long time. I haven't put it on my car, but why not start the new year off right with a video, right? So I'm gonna put that on the front. The Easy Lip Pro is gonna go on the front. Then I'm gonna um, put the side skirts on the side. But I'm about to show you how to um, prep. So you want to make sure you have some rubbing alcohol. It um it doesn't matter. Any kind of alcohol will work. This is a uh, isoprol alcohol. Um and I got a washcloth because you what you're gonna do is you're gonna put alcohol in the in the washcloth or your rag whatever towel and you're gonna wipe it underneath your um bumper where you're gonna apply the uh, easy lip the easy lip and the side skirt so you want to clean the surface underneath here so that it's um nice and clean no dirt particles get onto the sticky 3m tape to cause bad adhesion for it to stick so um let's start rubbing <laughs> so i'm putting the alcohol on the rag and then we're going to wipe it across underneath the um the bumper here get it nice and clean we want to get it clean for that maiden surface so you'll have a maiden surface for the um for the easy lip pro can't have it be dirty under there this is a really easy install you guys it don't even take that long once after you uh clean up underneath here it's simple all you do is remove the tape i'll show you guys just um, stay tuned in the video. If you need to put more alcohol on the rig, do so. Now we're gonna work to the other side. Ripped open the Easy Lip Pro. About to apply it on right now. We're gonna put this bad boy on here. Yeah, look how big this thing is. It's gonna be enough to go across your whole front bumper. It probably it's gonna be some leftover where you're gonna have to use um, some scissors and you're gonna have to cut this excess right here. I'll get to that point. Moving too fast. All right, let's go. Hold up. So you can play it now. It's already playing. All right. So we're gonna unravel this all the way out. All unraveled. Okay. See this red tape? 
this is what you're gonna remove. What you um, want to do is you want to give yourself an extra. You want to find where your groove is in your bumper, but you want to leave yourself with a little bit of extra um, of the uh, lip so you can have enough to cut. Okay. So probably about three inches or so, maybe, maybe not even that. So I'm peeling back the tape. Give yourself um, enough to work with. Um, all right. So make sure when you using this tape, when you move that tape, you ply it where you want it, cause it's probably ain't gonna be no second chance to to take it off again. bumper while pressing underneath it to get that adhesion going you want to put your thumb or your finger underneath it and press apply some pressure mild pressure that's help the adhesion keep it sticky I'm trying to make sure it's lined up real good I don't want it to overhang my off my bumper I want it to be smooth and crisp You getting good you getting good shots over here? Huh? Yeah. Make sure you're getting everything. already starting to form to my bumpers it, uh, you could have a bumper that could be straight across or you could have my type of bumper I got a body kit that an uh, HFP body kit that has a you know weird line across there like it'll go up and then down it'll form to any bumper you have so it doesn't matter what bumper style you have So we're gonna keep working. Okay, 
keep working across this bumper. All right, so I got it all the way to the end of my bumper. Now what you wanna do is take this long remaining strand here and you wanna cut it where it lines up with the end of your bumper. Let me cut this so I can get this out of the way. I don't need this, it's trash. So take a pair of scissors it lined up with the end boom and if it's a little bit off you can you could trim it up if you want if you like it's totally up to you I might I might drill you can use screws, but it doesn't require you to use screws because the tape is strong, but you can see it kind of, let me get you a little closer, kind of coming down on the edges. Now, across the whole bumper, it's nice, but right here, you can see it hanging down a little bit. I might screw it at the ends. Um, Maybe put a couple screws across. Uh, look how good that looks, bro. I'm gonna give y'all a good look, hold on. So yeah, that's what you do. Cut that end off. Um, excess um lip. Oh shoot! Let me get a far out look. Let's see. Looks good. Now that side needs to be cut, but it looks good. I'm gonna go and take the scissors and cut that other side. You can save your remaining pieces or you can throw them away. It's up to you. Same steps on the um, front bumper with the Easy Lip side skirts is the same thing you're gonna apply. The um, You're gonna make sure you do the prepping part, rubbing the alcohol and getting clean mating service for this to stick so 
we're gonna do that for both sides I'm gonna only show you one side but you'll get the gist for the other side but I'm gonna show you the finishing piece when I do both sides so I'm just gonna just show you how to do one side first So I'm cleaning it up right here underneath the side skirt. Um, like I said, I'm gonna do three tests. I'm gonna do a speed test, a curb test, and a car wash test. So I'm gonna put it through a series of tests to see how um, good this lip kit can hold. at the finish side one side of it look how crisp that looks matching up with the the front easy lip pro and then don't worry about this other side because I haven't finished that yet but now that y'all got the gist on one side you guess you could do the other side so, so finish both sides on this one and that side now and the front's done obviously but now look at that on the side i don't know if y'all can see that but probably had to get in some light but i'm thinking about um screwing this edges here because it's kind of hanging down so i want to make sure it's not going to fall off so i'm going to get my um drill i'm going to drill some screws into the sides one right there and on the other side maybe a couple here and those two sides too i'm gonna do one of the tests right now before i go off because sonic needs a wash boy he really do he's been sitting for a minute without a wash so i'm gonna make sure he can tell the wheel is dirty as fuck bro but um we're gonna um give him a wash i'm about to do this pull test and see if it won't come off seems firm i'm pulling on it super hard so that 3m tape is doing this job try the side skirts the side skirts are too as well as hard to pull so i'm gonna take it to the car wash do the car wash test to see if it'll come off during the car wash and right now after i'm uh, backing up i'm gonna do the curb test
I just did the bumper um test, the um curb test, and it's still on there, nice and strong. Let's get it. All right, you guys, I did two tests already. I did the pull test and the curb test. Now I'm about to go do the car wash test and the speed test. The speed test I'm gonna do on the way to the car wash. So stay tuned. Here I go. about to go walk out here right now to check the front of my car and the sides too it's still intact you can see it's still intact the sides see still in there still in there even the sides over here. So I'm fixing to go to the car wash now and um, show y'all if it'll stay on when I go through the car wash. So I'm here at the car wash. Got the car wash. I'm in the car wash. Still on there holding tight on the sides. That side's good. So that's a good, that's a bonus. I'm fixing to finish up cleaning up my car, but when I get back home, I'm gonna update you guys um, on how the car wash went and show you an overall view of my clean car with the lip kit on it. Right, Stay guys, tuned. So the kit was a success the lip kit um i showed you that it looked pretty fine on the car it didn't come off or nothing so that's a bonus and i rate this kit a 10 because it lasted through all the tests the um tape is really strong and it gives your car a good look this is the car cleaned up now look at my baby I want to put a sticker on here, like probably his name or something, Sonic, but overall it looks good. I need to get some wheels though, some rims and wheels. Give y'all inside look of my car after cleaning it. Look at the new mats I got. The mats that I got um, that we've seen in my car before look real, real dingy, real faded. So I got some new mats for Christmas to match the interior of my car. Look real nice with the steering wheel cover and the seat covers now. Tell me what y'all guys think down in the comments below. Two hitters go back, 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 back.
that guys that's it for the video um i'll give it a 10 like i said i like the lip kit it held up nicely it looks nice um let me know what y'all guys think down in the comments below i thought this would be a nice video to start the new year off with and hope you guys like it there's plenty more to come 2020 drop what y'all guys think i should do next in the next video and stay tuned for the next one mg mods is out peace